All right, coming in number five this week, we've got Abathur burrowing up to the top lane on Black Hearts Bay with one coin right there. Now, this looks like yummy bait for somebody on the red team, and there it is. False that flies into the trap set up by the blue team and gets taken out. A beautiful bait setup with that coin and Abathur. All right, coming in number four this week, we've got Nova on the blue team in a Dragonite that's about to die. Now, Tassar and the Vikings and the enemy team Nova come out from the bushes and destroy the Dragonite, but blue team Nova lands a nice precision strike while retreating on her pursuers, and now she cleans up Tassar for the triple kill, and Tychus comes in trying to finish the job his teammates couldn't, but eats a snipe to the face and gets taken out as well for the quad kill. And coming in at number three this week, we've got Butcher versus Stitches. Now, Stitches throws out a hook and manages to hook the Butcher, and he gorges him and brings him into the base for the kill. Butcher is in a terrible spot, but he then decides to turn around, gets the hamstring off on the Butcher, and starts attacking him. And his lifesteal is keeping him alive despite the tower damage and takes out the Stitches. Now, Tychus wants to finish the job, but the Butcher gets a Furnace Blast and a combo off on Tychus, taking him out before falling to the tower shots. And coming in number two this week, the red team is making a push play in the mid lane here on Cursed Hollow on the blue team's base. Now Tyrael charges into the fray and draws the attention of the four red team heroes. This sets up for a perfect Devouring Maw on four and Kelthus throws out a flame strike right at the end, instantly wiping out four players and destroying this push. And coming in number one this week, we've got the red team Jaina venturing out a little bit too forward when she meets the Butcher. Now the Butcher is going to charge towards Jaina, but Jaina runs into a little corner and uses the Water Elemental to block the charge from connecting, which would have meant certain death. And this gives her enough space to unleash her combo on the Butcher before he can react as Prey becomes the Predator and the Butcher gets taken out by Jaina. All right, and with that, that's it for this week's Hot's Hottest Top Plays of the Week. Remember, we have an in-game channel slash join Heroes Forecast if you want to come in, find some people to party up with. Anyways, if you have a baller play that you would like to be featured in a future Hot's Hottest Plays, go ahead and send the replay with the timecode and a description of what your play is to Hot's Hottest Plays at gmail.com. Thanks for watching everybody and I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. This is Balanced Breakfast and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.